This is a direct reply to Mr. I think I, I talked too much, whatever his name was. He left a pretty good response on my thing. Now, what do I mean when I say certain stuff? I, I forgot this bit video, but I'm pretty sure I remember the aspect of it. What I mean when I say certain people, I don't want to be around certain people. And I want to explain something right now. If you're in a group of black people and everything is fine and dandy and somebody from outside walks in, and acts a fool and walks out when people come check out the situation baby everybody that's in the building is suspect why because some people can't differentiate from how you look and how I look I can be someplace and somebody else black do something and everyone look towards me I'm tired of that shit black people fuck up sometimes white people fuck up sometimes but the thing is when somebody black does it did you see that video with the girl going off on the bus I don't need to say no more than that you could be having a shitty day or whatever what that girl did on the train or the, you, you seen the video Superman bitch what I'm gonna have you assassinated now, if somebody called the police and say it was a young black lady, you know, period, red hat, red shirt, whatever, that's all that is said. Every young black person, red hat, red shirt, is going to get jacked up. I'm tired of that, Look, looking like somebody that just fucked up somewhere. I'm, I'm tired of seeing young black people not give a fuck fuck and they do it in front of us as to, to show look what I can do I don't give a fuck that you can act a fool I don't want to see you act a fool I don't want to see someone pull you out of what you got to do because you acted a fool you understand that that makes me a supremacist a black supremacist a white supremacist. I'm a I'm a human supremacist. Cause if somebody wanna act like shit, and then they get treated like shit, and the first thing you say, why they do that to my baby? Cause she was fucking up. Cause they was acting a fool. One more scenario for you. It's seven of us outside. Somebody come down the street on the block, pull out a gun and start shooting. Okay, fine. One of us pulls out a gun and shoots back hit somebody right whatever four or five days later the guy that shot somebody gets shot and killed and the first thing oh why they do that to my baby he ain't never done nothing wrong he shot at somebody fucking five days ago little dumbass shit I'm tired of hearing grandmama's cry I think I said that in the song I had a friend of mine, and he said, um, man, if anybody fuck with my son, I'm going to fuck them up, da, 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 blah, 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 blah. And I told him, I'm like, what if your son went and fucked with somebody, and then somebody came and retaliated, and you went and did some shit? Yeah, I don't take care of these motherfuckers. And why don't you take care of your other five goddamn kids then? So, see, people felt right. If somebody fuck with my son, I'm going off too. Don't get me wrong. You know, I, I got other responsibilities too, but you have to look at the situation. What put these people in harm's way? Why was that girl acting like that on the train in the video? Why did the man get on the train trying to be hard? Perception. A lot of people think they can control you if they can scare you. Does that make me a supremacist? Because I'm not going to be fall subject to some old fucking ghetto time ass hooligans. That's stupid. It's fucking stupid. Showing your goddamn grill. Okay, fine. Can you eat with the motherfuckers? No. Then what you mugging for? Dumb shit. I hate dumb shit from any race. And especially my own. 
So I disassociate with the bullshit. That make me a supremacist? I once told somebody, and once I say this on the internet, it's going to be taken out of proportion. I would never go overseas and fight for this country. Never. Why? Because my grandmama told me, you don't pick no fight in nobody else's backyard, but if some shit go down here, here, at home, I'm going to need everybody to help me, no matter what color they are. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the real shit. Protecting the homeland. And you can't trust somebody who acted a fool 15 minutes ago. Because that person will try to shoot you and say you did it. He shot himself. You watch the boondocks? What they said about Katrina? Stupid niggas didn't know there was wind and a hurricane. They didn't have no wind insurance. Little dumb shit like that pisses me off too. How we can sit back and joke about black people like the shit is fucking funny. It ain't funny when people do dumb shit. So if you're saying I'm thinking I'm better than the next person, you gotta think you're better or else you just as bad. I am better than everything, everyone on this planet. I am the ace, number one. And you should think the exact same thing. And everybody out there should think that they are number one. You are number one. And if you don't believe you're the best, then you're what everybody tells you you are. And you damn right, I'm disassociating myself from the bullshit. The low, stuck to the turf shit. I used to been there, done that. That's why I think I'm better than everybody else. Because I have to believe I'm better to make myself. I am the shit. You are the shit. What am I supposed to say, you know? I ain't shit. I'm nothing. Everybody around us makes us what they want us to be. And if you don't think you're the best of all, of everything, then you're just what somebody's saying you are. A nigger. Yeah, I said it. A nigga. I ain't finna be nobody's nigga no more. But I can be one if I want to be one. I can speak in a manner to which I want to keep something too. And I can try to teach people right from wrong. You think that mean mugging, looking all hard and shit. What they say? Two things a black people, a black man can't do. He can't feed his family and he can't smile. Does that make any sense to you? How many times have you seen a picture of a black man and he smiling? How many times? You just take, you go to take some pictures of your family to be taking them. I told my brother, come on, y'all get around, man. Let's start taking. Why? We stopped acting a long time ago. Oh, yes, sir. I know. I'm going to do the minstrel show for you, master. And that's all. It's a big fucking minstrel show. And if you can't fucking see that, you can't. Man, why don't you save some money up? Go on a cruise. Go on a cruise boat. You out there, you're eating your food, you're with your girl, everything's fucking fine and dandy. Oh, don't get me wrong. I've been on lots of cruises. I'm just not talking. And you know when somebody out of place on a cruise. Man, this motherfucking shit. Another thing. I'm black as the ace of spades. And I'm going to say this. And I do this to myself sometimes. It could be 95 fucking degrees outside. What the fuck you need that big ass motherfucking jacket on for? I do the same shit sometimes. Four layers of clothes and shit. Three layers of clothes. I used to wear more than one layer of clothes because I used to do so much dirt. Take that shit off. There was a black guy in red pants and a green shirt. No. I'm wearing blue pants and a red shirt, motherfucker. Get yourself away from the bullshit. Then you sit back and look at it. Then you can figure out how to stop it. But until then, disassociate yourself with nonsense and then you will feel better about yourself and if you don't feel better about yourself after that point mister I talk too much understand this I talk more than anybody else and you just been tubed <laughs>